Well, this week, a federal jury convicted Idaho Representative John Green for conspiring to defraud the federal government. The case dates back to 2005 when he practiced the law as an attorney in Texas. According to a release from the Department of Justice, John Green's clients sent their profits into a trust account Green controlled. Prosecutors say they did this to avoid paying federal income taxes. Green was indicted in 2018. A U.S. district judge will set his sentencing at a later date, but according to the DOJ, Green faces a maximum sentence of five years in prison for the conspiracy count. Today was a, uh, a solemn and difficult day for the Idaho House of Representatives. That's Idaho's House Speaker Scott Bedke just minutes after the House unanimously approved Green's expulsion. Under Idaho Code 59901 and also in our state constitution, uh, Article 6, Section 3, that makes him ineligible or dis unqualified to hold civil office. Mr. Speaker, I second that motion. The motion to declare Green's position vacant today came 24 hours after his conviction. In our caucus, people, uh, you know, many, there were many opinions expressed. There was, there was empathy and sympathy expressed uh, to the situation, yet uh, uh, it became clear that we had a job to do and that they were up to the task to, uh, to do it. A temporary replacement has been sitting in for Green in the legislature since his criminal case started. Now, Governor Brad Little will appoint his permanent replacement. In the newsroom, Amanda Rowley, Crumb 2 News.